Inagata de Vida, one of my a song that goes back to my childhood that I just uh, was always fascinated by. Have shown it to uh, quite a few students over the years. It is a, basically a simple rock riff. Now, I, I have people usually do it with a power chord at the beginning, even though they didn't. It was really just individual notes with the bass and the guitar doubling what they were playing, with the guitar having a lot of distortion on it. So we'd have to. I don't know, can't really get that on the acoustic guitar. But um, nice little run that follows it. some chords, some simple bar chords with some simple strumming. So that is all that's going on with Inagata de Vida, except for the um, classical arpeggio org organ opening done over a D minor chord. And in the lesson, so in, I, I put together a lesson for this at Totally Guitars, and in the lesson we talk about all the easy stuff, and there is a segment though on arpeggios and how to play them very accurately, and, and, and some really good tips on how to make sure that... Every note comes out as clearly as possible with efficient hand movements and making sure that you've got the right finger going to the right note at the right place. So I do have a separate chapter, separate segment in the in the lesson on Inagata de Vida that talks about that kind of stuff. Now it's more of a classical guitar lesson because as you could tell by what you just heard there probably, it's a more classical guitar kind of kind of riff or lick. Not really a riff, it's a lick. It only happens once. Well, it happens at the beginning and at the end of the song. So, But if you'd like to check out the lesson, we got the easy stuff. It's like a level four. If you want to look at the, the arpeggio, it's in the level eight or nine range on our one to ten scale of difficulty. And there aren't many songs up, up in that range. So, But again, that part was not written for the, or not done on the guitar. But now since Eddie Van Halen revolutionized guitar playing in the 80s with some of his uh, techniques, those types, and the uh, Ingve, of course, a little earlier, uh, all those guys kind of contributed to that stuff being popular and common now among guitar players. So anyway, if you're interested in checking out the lesson, there are a lot, lots of other lessons that work on riffs and things like that, of course, too. Everything is at totallyguitars.com, and I hope you can uh, get a chance and come check us out pretty soon. <laughs>